Welcome back for the 12th chapter of Red Book of Westmarch. Let's get right into it. So you're just going to open up the book. You're going to go look right at it. Get onto that second page because, you know, we're coming down to the final chapters here. It's going to be Fall of Isengard that we're going to go right into. Uh, here we're going to be switching it up, apparently. We're going to be getting those little uh, books for the, for the dwarves. You know, get yourself a nice little Gimli. Get a nice little Spear of the Rangers. You know, some Might Focus Speed. Sounds solid. And 100 Gems. Can't go wrong. Only got one. I do have skip dialogue and battle playback. So that way we can, you know, easily go past it. It's right down there, as you can see. But that is only available if you're replaying it. You're going to get 200,000 resources of each for everything you do. Honestly, look, you know the way the story goes, right? We got two armies to play with and to work with. But um, correct me if I'm wrong, but we don't need Merry and Pippin. All we need is Merry and Pippin. Because this is... The march of the Ents as they come to take down Isengard. Just send them one after the other, after the other, after all these foods. Because you know what? They can't do nothing against you. Look at this. We're just going all the way downtown. And just like that, Isengard has fallen. Saruman falls from the very tip and the very top and comes crumbling all the way down. And uh, that, that's, that's all there is to it. All right. Thank you guys so much. I'll see you in the next one.